in today's video we'll be talking about how you can use your android phone as a touchscreen for your windows pc let's jump right in so be able to use your android phone as a touchscreen for your pc you need this app called space desk you go to google play store download and install space desk on your phone and then open it basically what space desk is is a way of extending your desktop PC and then giving you a touch screen for you to work with. So this is what the interface of Space Desk looks like. Go through. So let's go over to the PC and see how to set it up. To set up Space Desk, you start by connecting your PC to your phone, either by connecting it to the same Wi-Fi connection, or you can use your phone as a hotspot and then connect your PC to it. Now, once you have connected your phone to your PC or your PC to your phone, you go to spacedesk.net. This is the website where you will scroll down to the downloads page. Click on download. You have different download buttons here depending on your operating system so you click the one that is relevant for your operating system if you are using windows 10 or windows 8.1 once you've done that of course i assume that you had already installed space desk on your phone so you just run the app so let's run space desk now that space desk is on let's see what happens on our app to be able to turn on the space desk server you go to settings and click on once you do that you can see that the space desk app actually acknowledges that there is a space desk server open so you just tap on the pc that shows on your space desk interface on your phone now that we have connected the two devices together so basically how to use this is this mobile phone right now works the same way your projector would work tap on windows p to select a mode in this case we are in the extend mode that means that we are trying to extend our monitor if we want to duplicate you tap on it, it switches and displays whatever that is being displayed on your PC screen. Now, you can practically click and drag items between the two monitors. Like in this case, you can just click this web page and drag it out to your Android phone. And you can, well, do the same. Assuming you have two tasks and you need to extend your monitor, you can click and drag apps between the two. Assuming you are running an app like a whiteboard app and you are carrying out, maybe you are teaching and you need, you know, you need to demonstrate something, you can basically duplicate your screen and use the, the smartphone as an extension of your computer monitor. So you can write whatever you want to write. When you are done, you can disconnect but let's look at the interface on the desktop so that at least we can get familiar with all the things that can be done. In this case, we have our IP addresses. If you want to turn off your first desk server, you can just go to settings and then tap off. Then it disconnects your smartphone from your desktop PC or your laptop, whatever Windows PC you are using. Then if you want to turn it back on, you can still run the app, go back to settings and turn it on. So basically, that's how it works. Question of the day. Is there any task you are trying to carry out on your Android device and is giving you a headache? Please drop such questions in the comment section below. So anyone that knows the solution can drop the answer for you or I can use those questions as a topic for subsequent videos. If this video was useful to you, please smash the like button and subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next video.